Now that we have a base page, let's create a home page on top of it. So remember, our base page implements the header portion as well as the footer. Our home page will implement the content portion, which includes this promo area and it's these two columns of content. So the first thing we want to do is jump back to our project and navigate in the content project to apps, AMCast demo, components, page, and we're going to be creating a home page, which is a type of landing page, so we'll create it in the landing folder. I'm going to create a folder called home page. I'm going to create a new XML file called content.xml.content.xml. Within here, we're going to set the primary type to CQ component as the page implementations are components. We'll set a title here. And then here is the important part. We are going to be setting the sling resource super type to be our base page. So we want to set it to AM casts, demo, components, page, base page. And this is going to allow our home page to leverage all of these scripts that we defined within our base page. So here we go. The next thing we need to do is just remind ourselves what we actually need to implement on the home page. So let's open the body and you'll see here we have our header portion that we want to persist throughout all pages as well as the footer. And it's really this main.jsp that we need to override uh, on a per page uh, implementation basis. So we're going to want to create a main.jsp in our home page. And this is going to have our uh, standard amcast global.jsp. What I want to do now is jump over to my static HTML and copy in all the content that I want to appear. So it's going to be from uh, the promo down to the sidebar. Let's paste this in. The next thing we want to do is replace all of these portions of hard-coded content from my static site with components that will allow us to dynamically author content within CQ for this page. So for this, I'm going to use CQ include. I'm going to set the path to be promo text. And this name, of course, is arbitrary. This is just the name of the resource that this content will be saved to under the page. It is nice to make it uh, meaningful. I'm just going to pick some out-of-the-box components for this. Foundation, components, text. So this is just going to be some text. Go ahead and copy the CQ include. This section here, we're going to use the parses component, and this is going to allow authors to drag and drop multiple components in. So an author would be able to drag a title component in for the H1 tag and uh, text components in for each of these paragraphs. So go ahead and paste this in. And I'm going to call this main par. We're going to give this a resource type of foundation components parses. Just copy the same thing, bring it down to our sidebar. I'm going to call this sidebar par. And there we go. So now we have our main uh, JSP implementation. The last thing we need to do is create a template. And the template is what allows authors to actually select the page type when they go in and uh, select new page from the WCM UI uh, to create new pages. So to do this, I'm going to go ahead and make a new folder again, call it homepage. And this name can actually be totally different um, than our page implementation, but I'm going to keep them the same for this example. I'm going to create a .content.xml to define the node. This type is CQ template. So this is a special type. We're going to give it a JCR title, and this is going to be the title that's shown to authors, so you should try to make this pretty meaningful. And we also can add a description here. And again, this is uh, shown to authors, so we should make this fairly meaningful and helpful. There we go. We also need to say where this template is allowed to be used. So I'm going to say allowed parents. I'm going to give it a property here. I'm going to say anything under my AM casts folder should be allowed to create this. So the last piece we need is actually to define the sling resource type whenever we recreate a page using this template. So this is a little bit different. So what we're going to actually do here is uh, close this out. Let's get rid of this. What we're going to do for this node, we are going to add a JCR content node. We're going to give it a JCR primary type. 
and this is going to be CQ page content. And importantly here, we're going to have a sling resource type. This is going to actually be copied down when we create this page. And it needs to be the same resource type as our implementation. So this is kind of where we bind the two things together. So we're going to have AMCAS, demo, components, page, landing, home page. And we can just close that. Get our formatting done here. All right, so this looks pretty good. Uh, now we should be able to deploy this project to our local uh, authoring instance, and we should be able to create a new uh, homepage, um, and we should be able to author it using the CQ component tree. So let me go ahead and install and build this using our Maven project. As you can see, it's pretty fast, so now we're done. Let me jump back over to CQ author. I'll refresh the page to make sure that uh, everything's loading properly. I'll say new page. Here's our AM cast demo homepage we created. Go ahead and create a page. Let me open this up. And here we go. We have our AMCAS homepage, we have our promo area, and we have our two, two drop zones here. So I can go ahead here, go ahead, open this up, and say, Welcome to AMCAS demo. And if I like, I can come into my sidekick and I can drag uh, some components in. I can add some text here, I can add a, a couple text components if I like. Actually, uh, come back to my static page, drop some in, I'll just use the same text again, shorten it up a little bit. There we go. We can do something very similar over here on the right side. And again, this is all just uh, all just out of the box CQ components. So none of this is necessarily styled exactly for uh, for this, um, but you can see how easy it is here. And let me go ahead and paste in some more dummy text. And there we go. Now we have our homepage.